All right, morning, morning. Today we visit kind of a scenic spot uh, with cool rock formations on the seaside. And then uh, we go up a mountain to a temple. Should be, I think, less than 140K, so a little shorter than yesterday. Uh, I have to say I'm a little tired from battling the wind yesterday for 185K, so... Yeah, that guy was uh, doing that at 3 a.m., so uh, a little bit sleep-deprived also. Um, I'm going to take it nice and chill. Uh, guy here uh, made me breakfast uh, for 500 yen, and I had to take a peek, uh, and it looked really good. So I think I'm going to eat it while I kind of check out the ocean by the cool rock formation. And that's 36k away, so I'm gonna take it slow today. There are some hills on the way. So I think maybe an hour and a half for that, going nice and slow. Uh, but yeah, we'll see how the lights feel after I get them spinning. Because usually they feel kind of crap when I wake up anyway, so. Um, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, let's started slow this morning. すいません。何を撮ってるんですか。あ、海ですか。え、ちょっと見てもいいですか。すごい。<笑> え、いいんですか。ナイフかなんかある。ほら、食べてみる。食べて。おお。めっちゃ美味しいじゃん。美味しい。すごい。いつもだったらもう少し身がこぷくっと入ってるんだけど。いや、これで。今年あんまり草が
they're still alive. Ready, so I'm at the top of this climb now. I have a view in front of me, so I'm gonna have a go at the sea urchins because I don't know how long they last. Even though they're still moving around, so I, I know they're alive, but um because yeah, sea urchins can stay outside of the water for a while because they live in the tide pools and stuff, so but we're gonna have a go at them. So I have my tool which is not supposed to be used for this, but who cares? It's for my bike and the brake pads, but that's okay. Uh, so we're gonna crack them open and see. Well, I know what's inside, but it's gonna be kind of a fun experience. And then I'm gonna have them with the rice ball that the monk kind of made me for breakfast. Uh, so yeah, thank you, Mr. Sea Urchin, for your contribution. Uh, not really sure how to do this, but it's gonna go st straight in. And that. And the other side, because she split it in half like this, so. <clears throat> Alrighty. It's gooey. Ew, but the goods are there. The goods are there. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna clean that out in a sec, but, oh yeah, and then she took this part out too. She kind of just tossed it away, so I'm gonna do the same. I think this is the mouth. So. Gotta clean out the rest of the gunk in there, but yeah, it's looking good so far. All right, thank you, sir, for your contribution today, Mr. Sea Urchin. And go like that. And we're gonna go like this. And we have so this one's got I, I know there's stuff under there, but a little bit you can see a little bit peeking out. But this side, oh, oh boy. Alright, we're gonna go clean this out and then I'll get back to you guys, okay? Okie dokie. So after we cleaned it up, look at how much we have. Look at that, that's pretty good. That's a lot. And the rice balls. Okay. Clean. Nice and tasty, I think so. Yeah. It's looking good. Um, and we're gonna enjoy it with these rice balls from the monk. So this is amazing. This is a great breakfast. So I'm gonna try it out. Okay, here we go. Let's see here. Be careful with these. Oh, look at it. Look at it. Mmm. Oh, that's so good. It's just so sweet. And the texture's so nice. It's not like squishy. It's got the little, almost like little eggs, you know, the, the little popping. But yeah, that's really good. It's really good. Let me have some more. Mmm. Now I'm gonna have that with a nice rice bowl. Cover in seaweed. Mm. I don't know what's inside, but. Hmm. Oh. Plum. Mmm. I am very satisfied right now. Mmm. Eat it with these pickles. Very crunchy. Mmm. Nice and salty. Delicious. Amazing breakfast. Uh, now it's some downhill. But uh, unfortunately, we have a lot more climbing today. So, uh, uh, gotta get going. And uh, it's cold a little bit, especially on the downhill. So, I have actually a coat on today, which is first of the trip.
Okay, I think finally the big climb is over. I've climbed up uh, 1,200 meters in the first 50k, which uh, has been kind of tough. But uh, I think we're finally at the top uh, because look, no, nowhere else is there a higher mountain. Okay, so that means we're at the top of the tallest one. So yeah, that means there's no more climbing. We're only a little bit, so. Um, it's been tiring, I mean, it's been taken. It's been like 7% the whole way, so, uh, <laughs> but now it's downhill, I hope. Okay, oh God, careful little guy, Jesus Christ. Last snack of the day, a special Doriaki. Don't know what makes it special, but it's special. Mm. Oh, wait. I think there's like butter in there. Hmm. Okay. Not bad. Not the best one I've had. Okay, done with my day. I cut it short at 115k because uh, my legs felt like toast. Um, so there's a, a shrine at the top of a mountain uh, that's 13k away from the hotel. So tomorrow morning, uh, the plan is to just go up there and uh, have a look around. It's supposed to be really unique. And then I head off to uh, Aomori City. So. And I'll be taking a few days off in Aomori City. Um, just maybe to work on videos. I'm sure there's a lot to see. You know, it's famous for apples. That's pretty much all I know. But I'm sure there's a lot to see. It's a big city. Uh, and I really rest up before we head over to Hokkaido. Where uh, um, we're going to rack up some miles. Uh, we're going to spend probably four weeks in Hokkaido. So... Um, I'm a little anxious about that, a little scared, but um, I'm sure everything will be good, so. Today was really a mixed, uh, mix of feelings, you know, like, morning, I mean, I was tired, but I thought it'd be okay, and then, I guess yesterday just really uh, took it out of me, so, um, and then I ended up climbing a lot, like, uh, 1,400 meters for the day, um, after yesterday, that was enough to beat me up, so, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna rest up, uh, do some, do a bit of work, and uh, yeah, see how I feel tomorrow. Hopefully, better.